Have you ever felt that as we grow older, we lose more and more friends? We miss that moment when it is so easy to make friends and just spend our boring days with our friends. Play games together, binge watch a TV series, explore a new city, wear matching outfits, shopping, have coffee dates, late night talks, or just long walks to anywhere. Perhaps life seems more exciting when you have a lot of friends. The problems in life feel lighter when you have someone to share with. The happy moments in life feel more joyful when you can laugh together with other people. Sometimes it feels quite frustrating when you have to deal with your life alone. Loneliness is a state that most people are very fearful of. There is no one to talk with, no one cheers us, no one to cry with, no one to have fun with. I used to feel guilty and question everything whenever I lost friends. I used to think that friendship is supposed to last for years or even until the rest of my life. I used to think that it was a sign of loyalty to the people in your life. I used to always hate every goodbye which led me to kind of force a relationship even though it's not really work out anymore. Otherwise, it made me blame my circumstance or my friends, assuming that they are not truly good and real friends. One by one, they are all living our lives. Jokes, laughter, and the fun things that we used to share before are now just mere memories that remain in our minds. Now, it is just ourselves in the room. We have to embrace this all alone. You may question yourself like, what's wrong with me? Why do my friends stay away from me? Why do I have no friends? However, I want to tell you that there is nothing wrong with you. Losing friends in our 20s is a really normal thing. In fact, Losing friends is a sign that you are growing. The more you grow, the fewer friends you'll have because now you don't have the same problems that you used to have before. So there will be fewer people who can relate with you anymore. We will change, our friends will change, and all of us won't remain the same. And that's okay because we're human beings and we're not supposed to be always the same for the rest of our lives. People come and go anytime. Appreciate when they're still with us and let go if it's time for them to go. I genuinely believe that we don't meet people by accident. Everyone in our lives has a role. Some of them gave us great experiences as well as positive impacts and some of them gave us sadness, pain, or negative experiences. No matter if it is positive or negative, they always give us something such as experience, impact, as well as valuable lessons which leads us to get to know ourselves more just with a different method. And if they go, let them go, send them love, and just say thank you because it means they have completed their roles and tasks in our lives. Now it's time for us to step to the next level in life. Well, somehow, I think losing friends can be a good thing because we need to lose something first for something new to come into our lives. The previous month ago, I read this from The Secret Book. A relationship ending between two people is the result of the two people is no longer being on the same frequency. When the frequency of people is no longer a match, the universe will move them apart because things have to fall apart to allow better and more wonderful things to appear. So this means when you lose a bunch of friends, it is because you're so growing that now you have a different frequency from your past surroundings. When you have a different frequency, you automatically level up your life because you no longer have to deal with the same old problems. You're reconditioning yourself to a new and better environment from your past, which means you're not stuck on your past. When you're growing, Certain areas of your life are supposed to fall apart because you're breaking the energetic bones between yourself and your same past reality. I mean, you never know what the universe has in store for you as your old reality falls away and the new one begins to unfold. Anything that is no longer a vibrational match between you and your future is going to fall away and just let it. 
there is no need to put your old life back together because you're going to be way busy with your new future reality. One thing that I can assure you is the unknown will never let you down. There are so many incredible things left in the unknown waiting to be found by you. If you focus on your past and the known, you'll just get more of the same. If you focus and be open to the unknown, you create a possibility and you'll get different experiences in life. As for me personally, I feel like I always lose friends and people in my life. I used to think I am such an unlucky sad girl, but over time, I can understand that this is the universe preparing a wonderful gift for me. A gift contains tons of exciting unexpected things that are about to come into my life. And yes, it does happen and it always happens. I'm talking about the fact that every time I lose something, sometime later, new and even better things come into my life in a most unexpected place that I couldn't even imagine before. Every time I lose someone, every time I lose my friends, not long ago, I will be attracting new people into my life effortlessly without me trying to find new people. I don't know, but they're just coming somewhere and we're suddenly connected. Now there are people who are aligned with me, the upgraded version of me, and my new evolving value. People who bring out the best in me, people who let me know more beauty in life, and people who serve my highest good as well as help me to achieve more and more great things in life. So if you're feeling lonely and losing a couple of friends, please now know and see it as a good thing. There's no need to pity yourself, no need to put your old life back together, no need to question people in your life who now act differently to you, no need to chase or back to back to the old relationship. All you need to do is to just feel happy and joyful. Enjoy your growth, fall in love with your life, and be excited about what's about to come. Because when you're happy and joyful, you're in high energy. And when you're in high energy, it's such a magnet for the good things, people, events, circumstances to come into your life. They will come in the most unexpected places and times, easily and effortlessly. Well, just prepare yourself and when it comes, there is no doubt that it is a gift from the universe and it is you who are attracting them with your happy and joyful state. Alright, if you found this video helpful, let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and while you're waiting for the next week's video, check out this playlist that I have for you. Thanks so much for watching, please subscribe if you aren't ready and see you.